Welcome. In front of me is a Motorola G50 and today I will show you how to enable the talkback option on this phone. And to get started you want to open up your settings and then here scroll down to accessibility which is somewhere at the lower half of the settings page and in the accessibility you will be able to find the talkback which looks to be right at the top right here. Once you click on it simply want to enable use talkback. I'm gonna move it Welcome closer to, to the microphone so you can see it. Hear it. Screen reader intended for situations or people who have difficulty seeing the screen. It gives you spoken feedback so that you can use your device without looking at the screen. You can turn talk back on or off by holding both. Sounds so anyway, I'm gonna uh, mute it just so I can actually talk. So. Going back to the talkback, uh, whatever you will select, uh, talkback will uh, read through it. So if I tap right here, it starts reading it again. Now I'm gonna. There we go. I'm gonna completely mute it. So uh, you can tap on the things to select, and then the way you navigate through it is, for instance, you swipe from side to side, and it will go to well the next page, kind of like you would be pressing tab on your keyboard using Windows. And then double click anywhere to basically confirm whatever is selected in green. Now, every time uh, you select something by swiping, so as an example, by swiping right now, it selects next. Uh, Talkback will tell me what is selected right now. So, if, for instance, next is what I'm want, what I want to accept. I'll just double tap blindly on the screen, and it will accept it. And if I want to do close, I'm just gonna swipe to it. It's gonna tell me that it's now selected close. Double click it, and give me close tutorial. Um, basically read this entire thing so I can now swipe through it uh, stay in tutorial then close again double tap it and it closes it now uh, that's kind of the general way of navigating the device there's also additional ways of navigating through it like using your two fingers to scroll up and down you can do it by basically constantly swiping as you can see uh, but assuming you don't want to do that um, maybe you actually can just somehow use the device also I can use like I said two fingers to navigate if you're using gesture navigation which might probably not be the best way of navigating to the device with talkback uh, then you can use those gestures by just swiping with two fingers instead of one as you would normally do so if I want to go back which is the just swipe from the side I'll use two fingers now assuming it actually works there we go it's a little bit iffy and same goes um, for scrolling and going home. Now, whenever you select something, like I mentioned, you can also tap on it. You don't have to swipe through it. You can just pick it yourself by tapping on the screen on a specific option and then double tap it to confirm it. And because I want to turn off talkback, I'm just gonna go back here and again, select this. And there we go. So anyway, this is how you enable it and generally navigate through it and I guess probably the most rudimentary way. I haven't really uh, doubled far into the talkback and all the settings that it has. Uh, but obviously it helps people use the device if they are visually impaired. So anyway, this is where you can find the setting, how to enable it and use it. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe and thanks for watching.